Hey everybody, what's up? It's Marlon again. We are counting down 2022 and getting ready for 2023. I want to see if I can finish this video up in about two minutes and 22 seconds. So with that being said, let's just hop right into it. Okay, first, for all of those of you who are going through any anxiety, distress circumstances, complexities, uh, anything negative at all, just know that things are not always going to be like that, we love you and we are praying for you. So let's top right into, or let's start right into this video and talk about how we want to end 2022, all right? I have a suggestion. Let's end 2022 with a loss. How about some major losses? Yeah, you heard me right. Let's end it with a loss. Now, when we think about loss, we may think about that as something negative as a deficit, as something that has been taken away from us. No, let's think about loss this way. Let's end this year on a loss which starts next year on a gain. And I mean it like this, all right? If you are losing something that was supposed to be gone, you therefore are gaining something great in return. For instance, if you lost a bad attitude, that's a gain. If you lost some weight, then that's a gain. If you lost some negative influences, or maybe you had to cut some people out of your life, that is a gain. Any time that you can lose something that negatively affected you or held you down, held you backwards or weighed you down, then you can count that as a gain. Let's end 2022 with some major losses. That way we can start 2023 with some major gains. I'm Marlon. I'm happy to inspire you, encourage you, and motivate you to have some major losses for 2022 and great gains for 2023. And I will be looking forward to catching up with you real soon next year. Oh yeah, I think we did that. <laughs>